Okay, so I'm kind of excited because we're getting ready to go on our beach vacation, but before I left, I really wanted to try this Pin Busters. Um, one, because I really love avocados. Um, and two, I thought it'd be a good easy breakfast to make on vacation. So if you take a look at this picture, you'll see that it looks like they just sliced the avocado, um, just took the edges off, popped an egg in, cooked it in a skillet for a few minutes, and voila, you have this delicious egg that the yolk just runs out over the rich avocado, sprinkled with coarse salt, and it's delicious and made in five minutes. But does it work? I don't know. It doesn't make sense to me that by the time the egg cooked through, the avocado wouldn't be mush. Let's find out. According to the pin, you really just need to slice off the end. Ooh, nice green. So that it can sit fine. And then um, slice it down the middle. Voila. So now that we've cut our avocado, the tricky thing is you got to make enough room for the egg. And I don't think that seed space is going to be it. So let's cut a little more out. Also, you're going to need some space for the... Um, <laughs> for the egg to touch the bottom of the skillet. So my skillet is getting hot. I turned it on about medium heat and spread a little olive oil in the bottom. Normally with eggs, I would use butter. So I'll turn it this way so you can see it. But um, I think this will be better. Moment of truth. Let's see if we can get an egg in there. I don't think that hole's going to be big enough. Eh, no. It didn't work so well. So I took the other half of the avocado that we had saved, took the seed out, and I'm going to make a little bit. I need to turn this down so it's starting to splatter. Um, I'm going to make a bigger hole. kind of sucks because then you lose avocado, but there's just no way an entire egg is fitting in there. Mm, still too much egg. So here's the problem. The bottom of these, uh, the whites are starting to burn and the avocado sticking to the pan and the yolks haven't even begun to set yet. So, pin doesn't call for this, but what I'm gonna try is adding a little bit of water, a couple tablespoons, and putting a lid on it and seeing if the steam will help set the eggs a little bit. Worth a try. Terrible. Certainly not the prettiest thing I've ever seen, but I think we can work with this. It's not as pretty as the pen. Um, I'm just going to need a little coarse salt some fresh ground pepper. The real key to having good eggs is what does the yolk do? That actually looks pretty good. You want some? Open it up. But not bad. It's a little bland. I'm thinking maybe if we melted um, nice sharp cheese on top, that could be good. Could drizzle it with truffle oil, which you know is my new best friend, but aside from being a little bland, it's not that bad. So while it is not quite as pretty as the pin that we saw on Pinterest, I'd say this is plausible. You just gotta tweak it a little. Just bring your paw.